Um, to, to be fair, I mean, if, if I looked at the the draw when I first got here, and I mean, Nathan was um, didn't scare me. Um, I played better players than Nathan and beaten them, but that's no disrespect to Nathan. Um, the lad's a great player. He's a, he's a nice lad. He's a great player, and he'll he'll win copious amounts of more tournaments. He, he just will. That's that's what he does. Um, that didn't worry me a little bit. Now let me tell you a secret. Now I've known Gary for 20 plus years, and I sat and I watched him for three to four hours of practice, and he was hitting 130 plus average for the entire time. Now, I'm one of the world's best. Even when I was world number one, I couldn't do that. Now that scared the living crap out of me when I say that, and he's the only player that's ever done that to me. Taylor, not bothered. Van Gerwen, not bothered. Gary Anderson, puts the wind up my sails. Seriously, that guy can be that good, and he he scared me, you know. And and that is what Gary does. Tonight, I took it to him, and I, I got a decent lead on him. All right, he got it back, but I played on his weaknesses, which are missing the occasional double, and I took my chances. So happy days. Is that one of your best TV performances and results in um, recent years? No, no, it's, it's um, maybe in recent years, but not, it's, it's nowhere near um, best performance and, and best result. It's Michael Smith in the quarterfinals. Yeah. He's rekindled some of the form he showed last year. Are you going to have to come out of the blocks and give it to him early as well? Um, well, that, <laughs> that's what we're going to try. Um, you know, I mean, <laughs> whether it goes that way or not, I don't know. Um, Michael's a great guy, I've, I've known Michael a long while and fantastic player, but at the end of the day, if I, if I come out and, and sprint away, great, but you've always got to be expecting that surge from Michael, same as what you used to get from Taylor, you know, um, 180, 180, something else, out, bang, 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 180, out, and he, that's the sort of thing he does, so if it doesn't, if it doesn't, scare you when he does it, you take it on the chin and then do the next leg and then come back in the same. And that's not a problem. But if you think, whoa, hang on a minute, whoa, all of a sudden you're going 41, 60, 45, then he'll just rip you a new one. We know in Prague you struggled with the heat on the Eurotour. Yeah. And it's obviously very hot in here as well. Any yep. Ill effects were you back to full half after that struggle with the heat? To be honest with you, this is uh, nothing compared to what it was like in Prague. Um, people shouldn't be, shouldn't have been playing and shouldn't have been working in that heat. It is ridiculous. It was over 65 degrees on that stage, um, and I was moving. God knows what it was like for the for the officials that were standing there and not moving. I mean, they must have been melting. Uh, many congratulations on a fabulous result here in Blackpool. Cheers. Thank you. Best performance.